Dahlia, and we're back to bring you another review. Let's get started. This is the Sedici Alexi 2 Mesh Women's Jacket. I purchased this jacket in person at a Cycle Gear in Oregon, but this jacket is available on the Cycle Gear website for $219.99. The Sedici Alexi 2 offers both hot and cold thermal protection while riding, which was a major focus for me living in Oregon and wanting to stay within a budget. With 600D Dobe textile and hard mesh, this jacket has extra protection and abrasion resistance without losing airflow. 1200D reinforcement located on the elbows and shoulders adds even more protection, which I greatly appreciate. With two removable liners, one being water and windproof and the other being thermal, there are limitless ways you can be comfortable and protected while on the road. Super important when buying a jacket with weather versatility. The thermal liner is a full sleeve and has 100 grams of thermal insulation with 60 grams distributed even in the arms. It has an internal dry pocket and zipper connects to the waterproof liner for complete protection. The waterproof and windproof liner is also full sleeve with integrated mesh allowing for ventilation. And I'm sure this will be helpful in the summer days, which I have not used this jacket yet. Both liners come with color coded attachments, which are located at the wrist. This was something I didn't know I needed until I used the jacket on days with differing temperatures. It's fluctuated to a little bit more cold than I'd prefer to maybe the sun's out and not too much colder. The color coding makes it super easy to switch liners as needed, which was useful to me just getting my gear on and off. This is a CE level two armor protected jacket with elbow and shoulder inserts. The jacket has a sleeve for back protection, but it is actually sold separately. So you'll have to buy that on top of the jacket and add it into the sleeve. At the shoulders and elbows, they have added accordion stretch panels, which help you ride comfortably without feeling constricted or tight. When I am fully loaded in this jacket, this really makes a difference in how comfortable my arms are in the riding position. I don't feel constrained at all. The collar edge has neoprene, which makes the jacket comfortable while fully zipped. Bicep, forearm, wrist, and waist straps allow for loosening or tightening, helping to tailor your fit whenever needed. This jacket also has a pants connection, making it easier to ensure your back is covered. Okay, let's talk about what I like about this jacket. So this was my first purchase when I first got into writing and I wanted to stay within a budget and I wanted to make sure I had all my boundaries covered. And I live in Oregon and the weather is very erratic. Uh, super hot, cold, windy, rainy, icy, hail, bleep, bloop, blop, blop, bloop, everything you can imagine all in one. So this jacket definitely has that covered. So we'll go into the liners really quick. Super seamless. Integrated very well, easily accessible. And your total seamless unit with this jacket. So winter, 100 grams insulation in this thermal liner here with even distribution in the arms. Definitely helps with not being bulky, not being uncomfortable and staying super warm. This thermal liner integrates with the wind and waterproof liner. So when you're, you know, riding in a torrential downpour, got yourself covered as well as riding in the gorge and the wind is uh, throwing you to and fro, got you covered. And then the outside liner with the textile fabric and the mesh inside, perfect for breathability. I haven't worn it in the summer, but definitely looking forward to not sweating my ass off, which will be great. The other thing about this jacket is all the pockets. So like, I like to put Skittles in this one. And then in this one, I like to put like um, some chocolate because you got to balance out the Skittles and the chocolate. So I like chocolate Rocher in there. And then this is for my phone because, you know, I have to like do it for the gram all the time. This is where I put the souls of the men that I've demolished in my life. This one, um, I don't know. This one kind of varies to based on what I want. Maybe a blade, maybe not a blade. I don't know. It depends on the feeling and how I want to go about my day. There's also a pocket right here and then another pocket right over here. So there's no shortness of areas to put your stuff. And the other thing for the price point and getting everything covered was the armor. I love the armor on here. It's 
plays perfectly for me. The accordion style elbows and shoulders make me feel protected without feeling like, you know, a bulky mess. The back protector is not sold with the jacket. You'll have to buy that secondary, but I, I love the way I feel safe with this jacket on. Definitely recommend. The color-coded placement for the liners too was certainly helpful so that I didn't become a mess taking things off and on and off and on and off and on and off and on and off and on. So that was very useful as well as the uh, when the thermal liner and the water and windproof liner are combined, there's a little tag here that keeps that together as well. The other thing I like about the jacket is its ability to kind of be sized based on what you need. So you've got the cinching spots here as well as at the wrist. And then I love the waist ones because the jacket's fully loaded. And so all I have to do is cinch my waist and it just becomes a part of my body. And I really, really like that. Kind of gives me a feminine form with a jacket that's pretty pretty tough and rugged. So with that being said, the only thing I don't necessarily, it's not really a dislike, but I wouldn't wear this jacket at night. It's got a ton of reflectors on it and I'm sure that there are other writers that would wear this. I personally would not wear this at night. I prefer something a little bit brighter. But with that being said, I would really recommend this jacket. I think it's a great buy. It has all your seasons covered and yeah, definitely a recommend. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, maybe put a little comment down below, let us know what you think, or give us some ideas of other things you'd like for us to review, and then you can always follow us on the gram. So, hope you like this video. Look forward to seeing you. Deuces.